What is up Flockers? That is my fellow Lockers and aspiring Lockers. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my lock essentials that I take with me in my travel bag for any type of beach trip or short little getaway. So if you wanna see those, then stick around. If you're wondering what's going on with the hair today, this is called the family is packing up for a beach weekend trip. So this is what we're going with right now just so that we can get packed up and things like that. But before heading out, like I said, I wanted to go ahead and shoot this video just so that I can show the essentials that I make sure that I have anytime I go on a short trip, whether it be to the beach or to the mountains or just anywhere when I'm going to be away from home because there are certain things that I need for my locks to make sure that I'm staying moisturized and whatnot like that. And the wonderful thing is that I was able to fit everything in this small little travel size bag. So let's get into those. The first thing that I have in here is going to be my bonnet, of course. Gotta have my bonnet and then I have a backup little kind of scarf situation thing. So if for whatever reason, I've, I've had a time where I accidentally left my bonnet in a hotel, an Airbnb, so I just try to travel and make sure that I have a backup just in case one gets lost or anything like that. So. I have my primary bonnet that I wear, and then I have my backup. The second thing that I have in my bag is a bottle of shampoo. Now this is the travel size, so obviously if you need to get on a plane, you can get through with this size bottle. And it's just nice to have these sizes when traveling because you don't want the big bottle of shampoo or whatever. But especially when going to the beach, for me it's important that I have some shampoo with me so that I can wash out that salt water from the, the ocean or the chlorine from the pool at least once while I'm there so I'm not just letting that stuff sit in my hair. Currently got it wrapped up in some saran wrap just so that it does not spill out while I am traveling, but yes. Get you some little containers that you can put you some shampoo of your choice in. Just makes life wonderful when traveling. The next thing that I have in here is just going to be a water bottle. Now this one is Curly Kids. It has been repurposed just to be a bottle full of water. This is not the original Curly Kids mix check texture hair care in here. It's simply water like I said, but yeah, just so that way I have a spray bottle that I can use while I'm out. Y'all know I love my continuous spray bottle, but that thing is like three times the size of this and it's just not conducive to traveling light. Would not fit in this bag, so I have a smaller water bottle for that. You can choose any spray bottle that you find. They also have the little traveler ones that you can get at your grocery store. So those are really helpful. And I just want to mention that everything that I'm showing in here that I bought that's not coming in like this type of container, but I will link everything in the description below so that if you are interested in getting these same type things that you're able to get them yourself. The next thing that I have in my travel kit is this little vial. Kind of looks like a perfume bottle or whatever. You could put perfume in here, but what I have in here is my DIY hair oil. You can put whatever hair oil of choice that you want in here, but what I love about this, one, the size, it's small. You can pop it into your pocket, into a bag, but it is a roller type situation, and it's just perfect for me because it distributes. Look, there's nothing on my hand right now, but it distributes light amounts of oil. I don't know how well that's gonna come up on camera, but it distributes light amount, light amount of oil, light amounts of oil, can't talk today. And yeah, so when I'm out and about, I can just go part my hair, you know, after a wash or whatever. I don't wanna bring a huge bottle of oil or anything like that. So I do have that so that I can go in, keep my scalp moisturized while I'm out on vacation or on a trip and away from home. So this perfect thing that I got off of Amazon, again, the link will be in the description below. It's a glass vial. It's very strong, very durable. I love it. I think it came in a 20 pack, so I've got tons of them. So if I ever lose one or break one, I've got more that I can whip up in a heartbeat. All right, this next thing that I have is probably one of the largest things that I have in here. But for me, moisture is important when I'm on a trip, especially when I'm going to the beach. You know, getting into salt water and into the pool with chlorine and then getting out washing my hair and stripping to get all of that out and clean it. It's going to leave my locks super dry. 
And so I do want to make sure that for me, I have a leave-in conditioner that I can go in with my oil and because you know when you go out to a restaurant to go and eat or something or you're just going walking around you don't want your locks to be crispy and crunchy you don't want them to especially with my hair being color treated i like to give my locks extra attention and just make sure that they feel nice and soft and moisturized so i make sure to take like i said this is large but lion locks locking moisturizer it's lightweight and healthy hair locking moisturizer this is one of the biggest things, like I said, that I have in the bag. I got this off of Amazon too, link below. It smells amazing. It's very thin, does not cause buildup for me. And I'm able to moisturize my hair in a quick go. And it's just, like I said, it smells amazing. So you'll get compliments on how great your hair and your locks smell after using this. So I keep this with me. As you can see, I'm more than halfway done with it. So I'll have to be replacing that soon. The next thing I have on my list is this bad boy right here. And you're like, you already said you had a bonnet. This is not a bonnet. This is my satin pillowcase that I travel with. And again, some people may say it's overkill wearing a bonnet and having satin pillowcase or silk, but I don't think so. Maybe your bonnet slips off. Maybe you're the type that doesn't want to wear a bonnet. I like to have double protection and it just, I don't know. I've gotten so accustomed to sleeping on it now that if I have cotton or something else that my face is on, it just, it doesn't feel right. So I keep this also from Amazon, satin pillowcase with me, folds up easily like that. Like I said, can go into my travel kit and voila. So I love that accessory. Keeps my locks nice and moisturized, keeps the moisture in so that they're not rubbing against cotton and just sapping out all that moisture from my hair. And the last item that I have on my list that I like to take with me is in this little bag here. It is from Grantiva. Got this from Amazon as well. And this is a traveling hooded dryer. And what I love about this is, okay, so maybe you went to the beach, maybe you washed your hair, you're getting ready to go out. The great thing about locks and micro locks is that you can let them air dry, no big deal. But if you're not wanting to go out with super wet locks or you know you're going to be in an area that's heavily air conditioned and you just don't want to have wet hair sitting in a restaurant or something, you can pop this on. If you're at a hotel or somewhere that has a blow dryer or you bring your own blow dryer, this is great because you just pop this on to the end of your blow dryer like that. You put this on. They've got straps and whatnot so that you can tighten it to your likableness and then once you turn it on this puffs up and there's little holes in this all over so that it evenly distributes the heat through your hair and like I said what I love about this is that I can have this going and I can still be getting ready so if I need to brush my teeth or wash my face or whatever you know if you ladies need to do your makeup you can be doing that while you have this on so you can multitask you don't have to sit there holding a blow dryer for 15 minutes while you're waiting for your hair to dry so I love this, it's super compact. Like I said, it squeezes up in a matter of seconds, like that. And then it comes with this traveling case bag that you put in your other bag. But it's just quick and simple and easy. And who doesn't love to be able to have accessories like that with them on the go? You can take your hair salon with you and it all fits, like I said, in a tiny bag. If you found this video helpful at all, please make sure to hit the like button. That helps the channel and also hit the subscribe button so that you can join the flock. All the things I showed in the video today will be linked down in the description below. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that have popped up. I'll see you there.